Welcome back. My name is Harry Tambuatko. You're watching Talk to Harry. We're talking about more on the environment. We have Vin Lava with us. Right before we took a break, I was challenging the thought, the very phrase, the very United Nations, the group of nations, the League of Nations, even the Bretton Woods Agreement way back in the 70s, was all created for the good of mankind. And yet we are the drivers. We both agree. Ms. Mr. Lava, who is our guest here, is also saying the very thought that we are the drivers of how we are ruining our environment because of more. We want more greed. We want more of everything. So we are driving mining to, its, to the hilt so that it can provide more. Your ideas you were saying, Vin, during the break, when we were younger, totoo, no? Ako, I remember discovering the calculator when I was already in high school. Gosh, that really makes me really ancient. But that's true. I remember watching the Beatles the first time in black and white. Uh, there were less cars on the road, uh, uh, less use of gasoline, but we were only 50 million people at the time when I was a teenager. So who is at fault? The promiscuity of the Filipino because we're growing so fast as a population at 1.7? Or is it the greed of the current population that is insatiable, that is growing faster than the population itself? Well, it's all rolled into one. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> so tayo pa rin ang mali. We have, we have people oh, like Apple comes out with a new phone, new no mm. iPad every Oh the new one's coming out in November. Oh so it's iPhone something to 8. have. Oh it's uh. something to have. Oh, Samsung and all the other So consumer driven consum it's not good for us. Well in the long run huh? you know before it hits us in the face let's slow down na. Oh, it, it might not hit us mm. but Subsequent generations will certainly suffer. This is a finite planet. At inuubos natin at a faster speed every year. Oh, kasi, ano, nag, like in the Philippines, ewan ko how many, ano, did they sell half a million cars last year? And it's still climbing. Oh, it's still climbing. Oh. But there aren't enough roads. Mm. So, it's a, ganun din mangyayari, sobra-sobra, pero wala ka nang mapupuntahan. So the problem is not innovation, it is not the natural resource or the mined minerals that are taken out of earth, but man's greed. We are the fault. We are the driver. You said it, not me. <laughs> so tama ginagawa nila sa Middle East. Nagbobombahan sila, they're reducing the population. Well, the, seen, what they're doing there is correct then. Uh, Gassing everybody, shoot everybody, create civil war. Tama, the guy that has a really bad haircut day every day across South, South Korea. Well, he's got the right idea then. Let's yeah. eliminate and reduce population so we have more in earth. Well, the Bible mentions the four horsemen of the apocalypse. That's the end of the Bible, yes. The, <laughs> the end portion, yes. Eriva. And, you know... I can't help but uh, read the Bible when I see uh, what's going on, yung mga end times. So do we curb mining? Do we curb, do we pay attention more to the environment? Or should we look at redemption or look at human beings? Is education fleeting? It's not there to help us. To, to, to Tayong problema eh. We should do eh. everything that we can. Because it's a planetary crisis, or if it's not one yet, it's going to be one pretty soon. It, we have to do. So everything. Gina's just fighting one war. G Gina Lopez is fighting one That's war. That's her job. The president is fighting one other war, be it for drugs or whatever. Because drugs are also created out of. Uh, it's born out of the land as well. Well, oh, chemicals. Chemicals, to chemicals, to. Oh, chemicals. So, uh, ang problema talaga, in tao, the human being. Well, yung ating attitudes at saka yung consciousness siguro natin. You know, like we were saying, our ancestors did with a lot less. Di ba? Just 40 years ago, you know. No, no, but before electricity and, and oil was discovered, 
they had to go to sea to get the whales, to get the mm. whale oil to lighten up the streets. Well, there was a Do we need to lighten up the streets at night? <laughs> well, there was a technology break. There have been technology breakthroughs, for example, renewable energy. Uh, although yung windmills have been there at saka water power have been there for the longest time too. Pero yung oil will also run, run out. There are only three there were only three trillion uh, barrels of oil produced by nature and we have w run through half of that. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, there's one and a half trillion barrels of oil still under the ground but it's getting more expensive to extract mm -hmm. it. Oh, that was, there are more of us who want to use it. I just read an article that the American Texan oil, shale oil uh, producers are on a spending spree considering they never really made any money and they're still fracking nonstop, uh, thinking, feeling one day in the future, in the next 10 years maybe, because they can frack nonstop. They can take so much more oil, produce more oil by fracking, than they can take out from the ground with Saudi Arabia and its oil. Well, uh, that, that technology requires a higher price to break even, I think. $86. Oh, it's in the order of $86. Uh, and they're now, of course, they, that's why. Since the start of fracking, they've been losing. Oh. It's been 10 years now. But in spite of that, there is no slowing down. They're still fracking nonstop well, with the belief that that's going to be the source of energy in the future. I don't know how they can afford to take losses or probably they're just uh, exploring. I don't know that they're actually extracting. Kasi if it costs you... The si economics don't make sense, eh, based on the oh. study I read about fracking. But going back to people, we are driving ourselves into a situation wherein we are painting ourselves at the end of the room or into a corner of the room, so to speak. Mm -hmm. And we are making it harder for mankind. So the problem is not really the environment. It's not necessarily just the miners. It's not the greed. It's not necessarily our politicians or the stupid leaders that we've had to bear in the last uh, 15, 16 presidents. So it's really, we are the problem. Well, uh, humanity has been compared to a cancer. cancer <laughs> So in other words, we're killing ourselves. Well, what does a cancer do? It just grows and grows and grows and overcomes its host. Correct until it just devours you. So, tama ang solusyon. You grab a good San Miguel <coughs> light at 5.30, as, as we call it, 5.30. What were uh, we saying? No, 5.30. 5 o'clock, 5 alak. Alak 5. Alak 5. Pwede na, enjoy ka na, tapos bigay ka na lang kaya. In other words, enjoy life. Oh, and, and live simply, Padre. Simply na lang ang buhay natin. Hindi, Ay, gusto ko ng iPhone 8 eh. Hindi <laughs> <laughs> ba? Ikaw naman. <laughs> What's wrong with a nice iPhone 8, di ba? Oh, tapos, ilang billion ang katulad mo? Oo, oh, di... At least, mas maraming billion, wala. Pag ako meron, okay lang yun. Again, it's human being ang problema, no? Di ba? Going back to the Gusto same... Gusto ko yan, eh. Gusto ko yan, eh, di ba? So... Kaya ko naman bayaran. Uh, so maybe it's the fault of Department of Education. We have to look for a fault somewhere. It must be our teachers. And uh, it's society. Yung values natin, eh. Kasi meron naman, there are other uh, options. Yung sinasabi nga nito sila, So Rizal was wrong. He's part of our history and our values. Siya nagkamali. Bakit? He should have lived. Huh? Eh, mali ang values natin, sabi mo eh. Di ba, he's one of the, those that Hindi, really created eto, our values. Economics na ngayon to. Yung, there's a, such a thing as steady state economics na hindi na yung growth. Okay. Basta human well-being na lang ang ano mo. Kung baga sa Bhutan, meron silang gross national happiness imbis na gross domestic. Uh, oh, gross national happiness. Diba? Mag good time na lang tayo, pare. <laughs> <laughs> and try not to use electronics and batteries. You just get more tired. Human resource. Oh, yung, ano, a lot of, a lot of the stuff that we have, we don't really need, you know, Ako nga mag, I've got a bunch of stuff in the house. Wala, wala na akong makilusa. <laughs> ano, no? kulang ka lang sa spring cleaning, pare. E, every year you have to take out what you don't use within a year and you haven't seen. It's enough. That's how you throw it uh, out. Hindi, kasi attitude ko, hoarder ako. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, diba? Uh, hindi ako nag, ayaw ako magtapon. Pero, hindi ka nagbebenta. Hindi ako nagbebenta. 
Eh, so, ganun. Eh, ako, kasalanan ko yun. Bili ako ng bili. Oo, uh, nga, no? Di ba? For example, oh, ganyan. Marami kang ganito, marami kang ganun. So, I wonder who we can pin the blame to. We have to pin it somewhere. And surely, mankind has learned not to blame himself or else we will commit suicide. Hindi. We have to learn from our mistakes. Mm. You know, what is the definition of stupidity? Making the same mistake over and over again. Gee, you're talking about the human being. <laughs> or are those the politicians? <laughs> but go ahead. Parang ganun definition of politician, but go ahead. <laughs> you know, huh? so, you know, we're talking about this late in life. So probably it should be taught in schools. You know, get uh, so wider dissemination. correct the values. Mm. Educate with the proper values. Oh. Reduce advertising so that merchandising doesn't hit us in the face and to make us want to have more. Oh, kasi, alam mo naman, sino ba yun? Si Bernays. Ano na... To make you want to desire more. Oh. Reduce desires. Oh. Material desire. Oh, yun. Kasi there's a lot of money eh. Which at that rate, I'll become a preacher. Because that's going to be the one that's going to make the most money. <laughs> Di ba? Because they offer all words and nothing else. And then they collect for it. <laughs> well, uh, now that you mention it, the Catholic Church has been around for 2,000 years. They have been accepted by a whole bunch of people. You know, mm. how many institutions, not to mention uh, organisms, have been around for 2,000 years? 2,000 years, man. Baka natalo niya pa yung mga ibang living organisms. Oh. Kumaba pa. So, you know, it can be done, eh. It can be done. The problem is, it has to be done. Well, if... It, diba, it has to be done. It's not it can be done. It's a matter of when we're going to start doing it. Yes. Because if we don't, we're just going to ruin the environment. And the environment is one thing that we require to live and to sustain mm. ourselves. But the problem is we're not ruining the environment. We are the cause of the ruin and our environment is deteriorating because of our desire. To our actions. Our, our actions. actions. Desire is nothing it, oh, nga, unless nga. you act on it. Mali ang topic natin sa show nito. Dapat to, how do we kill mankind? How do we reduce human life? Well, Dapat he, ganun, ano? Well, nature is doing that. Uh, ano, marami na tayo mga, uh, they're talking about pandemics. Ano ba yan? Yung Zika. Ah, uh, oh, yung no. mga bird flu. Bird mga flu. Ganun, no. ah, o oh, HIV. HIV. So, uh, nature is kicking in eh. Uh, o, oh, tapos, climate change. What happens with climate change? Oh. Cause of mankind, yan, again, huh? with the same, ruining the environment. Drought, mm. floods, landslides. Mm. Oh. And, you know, you don't have water, what can, how can you grow, grow stuff? Magugutom kayo. Magugutom kayo. So nature's, nature's also getting involved here. Mm. So Mother Earth is suffering, it has a disease called climate change, it has Humanity. a disease called uh, drought and whatnot, caused by the human beings who require Mother Earth to live in, oh. in harmony, ideally. Oh, for example, sa China, pollution is a big problem. Bakit nagkaroon ng ganon? Because Industrialization. Of the, sumobra. Industry, sumobra. And it's killing them. It's killing them now. Oh. Eh, kaya nga pumupunta na dito, kumukuha na ng lupa sa Pilipinas, ay lang natin bigay. Buti nga, binenta ni Noy Noy Aquino ng Scarborough, And di ba? Pero, so, pero sila Trillanes. naman, they're taking action. They're, they want to be the world's largest uh, renewable uh, energy They already producer. are right now, with solar and wind. Oh. So they're doing something. I, I wouldn't say mm. the same about the U.S. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Di ba? Although, China's the world's biggest polluter, they have recognized that. And As well. Oh. So, so, so unless man changes, <coughs> really the topic is not more on the environment, but how the hell do we control ourselves to make a better world for ourselves? First, how did we get here? How did this state of affairs come about? Well, the politicians drove us because they wanted to make more money. All right. The politicians aren't there for the money, they're there for the power. Okay. With power comes money. So it's the oligarchs. 
if the oligarchs. Either way, the point is, we are the cause of the very misery we are bringing to ourselves. That's the sad part. Self-inflicted. Self-inflicted. And the environment is part and parcel of human life. Our existence depends on it. Uh, and yet we are ruining it and we don't believe in it. Mm. And we won't put a stop to it. In fact, we're still creating bombs to eliminate more humans. Well, so yeah. human, man is working against itself. It is creating extinction, well, towards extinction. Parang ganun ang takbo natin, di ba? Baka. <laughs> oh, mali ang topic natin today. No? Hindi dapat more on environment, more on human beings. So. Biro mo yung girian. Naggigirian na uh, no? major superpower sa Middle East. Oh, isa yun. Oh, may girian dito sa Korean Peninsula. Ah, ngayon, hmm. ngayon. Oh, Nag-ali sila yung mga barko, eh, no? Oh, Ando eh. dyan, eh. Baka mabawasan tayo ng marami. Oh, Pag dito lang, nagigirian lang yung mga MNLF, MILF, Abu Sayyaf, di ba? Ah, barya yun. Barya, ah, barya yun. lang yun, barya, barya lang yun. Tayo lang tatamaan nun. Uh, hindi no, wholesale yun, retail lang yun. Retail. Because the bigger powers will eliminate bigger volumes uh, oh, oh. of people. They, diba? they have 15,000 nukes in their arsenals, which is more than enough to... Minus 59 that they blew up last no, week. Diba? I'm talking about nuclear bombs. Nuclear. 15,000. <laughs> 15,000, which is more than enough to wipe Literate out the, the world, the whole, the mother uh, earth. Uh, several so, times. Talaga. So, the big issue today, pala, it's not the politics, it's not Trump, it's not the rise of populist presidents or leaders, it's the degradation or the human being is dying. The human race is at a our race species. to eliminate. Our, our species. species. Uh, so, we don't need the aliens to come in. We are doing it to ourselves. Parang gano'n, ano? Oh. The alien is within us. Tayong alien because we are the ones who are eliminating our own species. So, if well, alien is us inside... Unconsciously, ah. We're do doing this all unconsciously out of ignorance. That's how stupid we are. Ignorant, siguro. That's how ignorant we are. Alam mo, in law, there's no rule, there is no space for ignorance. Eh. It's not allowed. Well... Diba? In, in the wild, ignorance kills. In the wild, ignorance will kill you. Oh, oh tama ka, no? Ayba. So man's stupidity has, is all with himself. Oh, God, how do we solve the problem, Vin? We've got to solve the problem of life. We have to have a meaning, diba, for life. Maybe in this show, we can come up with a meaning of life. Is that even possible, or is this a cartoon show? Well, it more people have to understand what we are facing. I say a lot of people don't know it. Eh? They just go about their day-to-day -day lives. Eh? Mm, they don't care. Better yet, they don't, they don't care. They don't know. That, you know. They're trying to make a living, going to work, come home, get tired, watch TV, go to sleep. But they don't. Hindi pa bukas ang mga mata nila. So it's really education. Education. Spreading but, the word. But do our teachers know what to educate the youth about? Well, I'm sure uh, in elementary schools, there are science subjects. Elementary, high school. So basic, you can learn already about the environment in grade uh, school. Alam mo na yan, madali na yan malaman. Uh, Which is why maybe today we look at the environment, sinisira nila yung bundok, madali sabihin mali yan. Hindi yung okay sinisira mo ang bundok. Well, uh, Values, value formation. Values formation. Vin, ano ba we, importante? <laughs> what would you recommend to our viewers as we go towards the end of the program? I'm doing this early to give you time to give a message to the viewers who sit here and they're awed, if not perplexed, with the conversation we've had because we seem to go out on a limb and yet blame mankind when the topic is about the environment. <laughs> and then finding out what drives the environment to its rot is the very same person who lives off it. And us, in other words, it's not Gina Lopez alone or the big miners and big investment and the banks. It's us who are the problem. What would be your message? Curb our desires. <laughs> Consume less. You know, hang on. 
you know, curb your desires. Alam mo, during Noy Noy's time, there was a guy, um, a whistleblower who said that, uh, di ba? Uh, what's his name? Jun Lasada. Di ba sinabi niya yun? Curb our desire somehow. Di ba uh, may sinabi siyang ganun? Philippine ganon? Forest Corporation. Uh, uh, di ba? But go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. No, well. Contam uh, contain your greed. Yeah, parang ganun. Go ahead, go ahead. Oh, oh yun, yun, yun. Uh, Sabi greed, like uh, that. You know, kasi we cannot go on consuming at this rate. Uh, you know, we'll run out of clean air. We'll run out of clean water. We'll run out of uh, land to plant our food. As it is now, a huge, a significant percentage of our our soils are already degraded. So, ano, we dapat simpleng buhay na lang muna ngayon. If we want, if we want our future generations to not to to have a good life or some, you know. Contain your greed. Contain your greed. Ladies and gentlemen, I know this might sound a little absurd because what we've <coughs> done is we've gone out on a limb trying to, and I'm, there I am prodding, needling, and I'm trying to push the concept who is at fault, what is at fault, and why the fault has even come about. When the reality is, it's really not about our environment. The environment is part and parcel of the human being, this human species, who needs and requires the environment to live along with it. And yet, uh, Vin Lava is correct. Uh, the land is not growing, because land doesn't grow like that, not necessarily like that, but it does by land accretion. No? I mean, OK, to a certain extent, that's incorrect too. But it doesn't necessarily grow at the same ratio that population is growing today. So it's not necessarily against the church saying, let's depopulate. It's not, it's not what the, the world leaders are doing when they're trying to reduce population. It's not necessarily that, but man's greed or desire to want more. In our wanting to want more, we are actually driving our environment down the drain by creating more mining mines to be able to get the natural resource so we can develop more, and all for that fallacy called for the benefit and good of mankind. Is it really? Obviously, it is to degrade and to extinguish man. So I was making a joke. I was being sarcastic many times in this program, in this very program, only to try and drive a certain point, that we are the problem when you talk about the environment. And when you talk about what we need in this environment, we are the very cause of why we are ruining what we require to sustain ourselves. So in other words, tayo nagkakamali. And uh, okay, what solution can I give you? Rat poison? No. Harakiri, that's been done by the Japanese. There is no real solution. I guess Vin Lava rec recommends tame your greed. So Jun Lasada was right. Diba? Control the greed. Can we control? Minimize. Minim but can we even do that as human beings? Can we do that? It's 2017. Can we, do we even have the propensity? Can we actually improve ourselves? We're supposed to, but it seems we are not. Well, like I said, it's not necessarily entertainment. It's critical thought. You may like or dislike me. You may hate me, but all you got to do is turn off that TV set. But because you want to hurt yourself more, you keep it tuned on and listen to this absurd conversation. Maraming salamat po. Thank you.